like the video and subscribe if you love Roblox. Boys, what is up? Welcome back to another video guys and inside of this video we are actually going to be going over how you guys can make custom balls inside of he <laughs> said balls inside of a build a boat for treasure roblox so make sure you guys all stay tuned throughout this video um so then you guys can actually see all how to do it because how to actually do this is kind of hard it's not very intuitive okay so yeah and if you guys haven't already, make sure you guys hit the like button, subscribe, and of course turn on the notifications that because do not miss a single below on the channel. Single this up below for treasure. We now got somebody new up in the fan Their name is Glitchy YT. Congratulations, Glitchy YT, for actually getting their name up in the fan If you guys actually do want your name to get up on the fan all you guys need to do is hit that like button, subscribe, and then of course leave a comment down below. All right, so there is multiple steps. You are going to need the collision tool, all right, and the scale tool to actually do this. So if you guys don't have those, I am very, very sorry. But basically what you guys want to do is you want to have anchor on, all right, and then actually build up about three or so, okay? The reason why you actually want to build up, all right, you cannot do this with it on the ground. I mean, I guess you might be able to with this tool now, okay? So if you actually did want to do it on the ground, um, basically what you guys need to do, okay, Okay, is exactly this but if you guys don't have this tool all right then simply just build it up here so that's what i'm going to do right now so um um so basically you can make this any why can't i place it there we go okay um so basically you can actually make this any size any color any anything all right so you need to place a balloon down right there then what you guys need to do is once you click to activate this balloon you need to go onto the scale tool and start scaling it all right i like to have my scale at zero that's my favorite size all right but you guys don't have to you guys don't have to do that all right you guys can have it on you know five or something i don't know okay but what you guys need to do is click this and then whip out the skill tool and catch it in the air all right so i like to just you know make sure it moves all right if it starts floating upwards you did it wrong do it again all right so you just have to be super super quick all right it might take a couple of tries but you know as you can see it is very very much possible okay so it used to be that if you actually went here and actually turned collision on off and then back on again and then unanchored it okay then what will actually happen is it'll just become like a normal little thing however it is obviously not all right this thing is flying away like where where's my ball going bro it's literally just leaving me that thing is <laughs> it's literally just leaving me bro all right so there has to be another way to actually do this all right and jesse tc was actually smart enough to figure out how to solve this problem and the solution is very simple all right basically it is to add weight to to this all right so as you can see guys the balloon is being created and oh it's already been created and now flying upward okay it is going excruciatingly slow though all right it's it's probably gonna be a second before it actually um starts trying to pick this thing up and as you can see it actually does pick this thing up all right very very slowly however i actually didn't think that this many balloons was going to be able to pick this thing up bro where's it taking me right now bro what is going on so yeah it's actually kind of cool how it can pick all of this stuff up i thought for sure it wouldn't have been able to all right i don't know why it's just starting to carry me through the stages guys i i, I want to go home okay i don't i don't want to i want to i don't want to be here anymore but we can actually do this strategy all right with the smaller balloons so anyway we do the exact same step so we go boom and boom all right now we got this okay so now what we can actually do with this all right is we can create and we can go inside of here okay and actually make this very very heavy okay so if we actually position our cursor right here look inside of here and then we just spam this block because this is one of the heaviest blocks inside of the game all right so we basically just try to put like as many of these things as we possibly can of course the smaller the block actually is you know the the less you have to really worry about it and then another thing that we can also do is actually change the transparency of this thing all right and you know it should oh wait no that doesn't that doesn't really help we need to change the transparency of all the stuff on the inside that's why having a little bit bigger of a ball would be better okay but um anyway who cares okay so we need to turn the collision off turn it on then turn anchor off and then we should 
Oh wait, all of the all the items inside of there are anchored. Okay, okay, that makes sense. And boom! Now we got ourselves a, a, a ball. All right, as you can see, it does roll. It's it's a little bit weird because it has all these cubes inside of it. All right, that's why I prefer also having holy crap. There's a lot of gold blocks in there. Having just a little bit bigger of a ball, so then one, it doesn't you know roll all weird. Okay, and yeah, we don't have to deal with all those problems. So how we actually get a bigger balloon is we simply build up a little bit. Okay, so we don't want it to get stuck inside the ground because then we have to use the trowel tool to get it out of the ground and I don't really know how that works so simply we need to scale this baby out all right so we just needed it a little bit bigger I think okay and then we can actually get this bad boy started actually I want this thing more centered like that perfect all right and then now we can actually go like this and then like this all right as you can see the balloon is much 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 smaller all right or a little bit bigger now okay so now what we can actually do is do the exact same thing again with the blo with these blocks right here all right and actually put these inside of there so it weighs it down guys illusions ghost is dumb all right better strategy better strategy than that one all right i keep trying to delete this but i forget that there's 90 gold blocks inside of there but um anyway so the other strategy that we can use also this seems to be one of the heavier blocks the steel okay but um basically we want to build this bad boy up quite a bit so we can get you know a pretty good size ball all right then what we can do guys is actually place the items the weight inside of it down first okay this actually might be quite a bit okay but um anyway i, I don't want i don't really want a ball this, like this is gonna be a huge ball holy crap all right and then what you guys could do to make it even heavier all right is again take more blocks and actually scale them inside of it as well and this will actually add even more weight all right and then you can do this again and you can do it again and then you can do it again all right and just keep on doing it and doing it and doing it all right and to make it heavier 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 all right so and then that way it'll actually hold up basically any balloon that you actually put inside of it all right so um we need to kind of place down the balloon and then we need to oh, we need to scale this thing out a little bit all right i don't want it to be too big where it's too much weight but we also don't want it to be too small where it'll simply just like kind of fly yeah, where it where it won't like encompass the all of the weights all right so it needs we need to find that like sweet spot okay so um this might be good all right right there that might work all right all right baby so let's try this bad boy okay wait you can see it on the bottom maybe that's not the best idea but um anyway so we need to we need to click this and then scale it all right so we need to go boom and boom all right and then now we caught it like holy crap this might have been a little bit too big um um yeah this this may be too big guys all right there's no way that it wasn't going to just take off with it all right there was there was absolutely no way maybe maybe this is a better size right here okay so this is much much smaller so we need to again do this strategy okay and now that's not even close to being big enough bro this ain't even close. What the heck? We're getting close. <laughs> we're, we're getting closer, guys. All right. So hopefully there's enough weight in there that I won't take it off. All right. So what we need to do is turn the collision off, turn it back on, turn the anchor off. All right. And I hope that anchor is off on everything. Okay. So there we go. There we go. There we go. So as you can see, if we select all, you can see that there are all of the blocks are still inside there. I just made them all invisible. Okay. No, no way. No way. It's not heavy. There's like almost a thousand steel blocks in there, bro. I have 52,470 now, okay, after deleting everything, all right. So there was almost a thousand blocks in there. What the heck? Okay, so I don't know why balloons are like the strongest thing ever. All right, if you guys were trying to do this on your own, I suggest making them smaller, much, much smaller, all right. If you're going to make a huge one, you're, the, the weight to balloon ratio is really, really weird. It's it's kind of hard to figure out, okay. So anyway, if you guys all did enjoy, make sure you guys all hit that like button, subscribe, and of course, turn on the notification. Still See you guys on the next video. Love you guys. I'll peace out. I'm Chris. Goodbye.